Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm doing a market review today of the SPY. Boy, what a nice rally we had in the SPY. I didn't really see the way we closed so strong yesterday. I knew we were, we were strong, and I knew we were strong in the gap down yesterday, but I didn't know we did such a big move. You could have really bought the market aggressively yesterday and went for it. Not the same situation today. We did gap up, though. We closed last night at 205.62 and gapped up today at almost 206, 205.99. Little gap up today in the market, but it was a long. It was, it was a long. And actually, here is what the market did into the open. It kind of pulled in a tiny, tiny bit, and you had to be patient today. You couldn't have been aggressive long the market, although I thought we might have taken off like a rocket, but we didn't. I just called the market long before this flipped on the 15 minute, and it's a nice, nice trade. If anybody did it, this is gonna go to 207.50, 208. Let's just see where this could really go today. 208. So the interesting thing is, I thought there was a chance we could make it over, make a new high before the end of the month, but then I was like, fine, well, we'll see. The holiday is next week, but here it is, November 17th. I did feel, though, that this was it for yesterday from the drop-off and then the hold yesterday, and this is before I saw how we closed. Now I have 100% conviction that we really are going to try to make a brand new high again in both the QQQ and the SPY. Well, the QQQs didn't make a brand new all-time high yet, but the SPY already did. But we could even get up over it before the end of the calendar month or into December. Either way, the close of the end of this calendar year will be so strong in the market. 215, 220. We're looking at some nice numbers here in the market as a long. I've been calling the market long all year. It's really been a wild ride this year. I predicted the volatility in the market this year. I didn't I didn't predict the anomaly gap down that happened, but I did predict about a year ago this would be a very volatile year in the market. But it was it it was it was unusual. Unusual meaning the volatility that happened was that we had this enormous gap down. That open swoosh reversed the swoosh, and then everyone thought the market was crashing, which I said no. And then everyone still thought the market was lower, which I said no. And even now, I don't even know what people think, if they think we're going to make a new high before the end of the year or not, but I know that we will. But it has been a volatile market this year. If you knew how to trade, you made a lot of money on it. And if you didn't, you could have gotten whipped. But the market was never really lower in the longer term, even with the anomaly day because it never broke the numbers to break the trend in the chart. Although it was it was wild, it was volatile, and there's there's no question about it. But this is a nice, nice, nice long here in the market today as a day trade. And you could have entered the market long yesterday for a longer term trade. We should continue this rally. Rally, 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 rally. We should continue the rally through the end of the week. And I said yesterday, last night in the webinar, I think, or or I don't know if it was before I closed out the room, I don't remember, I said somewhere yesterday that we really, no matter what, I knew today in the gap we'd be higher, meaning that if we gapped down today, I thought we'd be higher. If we opened neutral, I thought we'd be higher. If we gapped up, we'd be higher. So we gapped up today, came in, waited, held, and then rallied. So now I guess it depends where we close tonight. We're just, we're just going to keep rallying. Tomorrow will be another bullish day. It's just... And unless today is some insane, sane green day, which 208 is not an insane number, neither is 207.50. Tomorrow, we should have a nice three-day rally here in the market. So, got to pick the right things for shorts, which, which we always do. But a lot of things are going to have some nice rallies here with this market. Today's only Tuesday. So, we should have a rally continuation today, tomorrow, and could, could last all week. Three days at least, could be five of the market rally. So this is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh. If you have any questions, email me at melissa at Have a great day, everyone.